Hi everybody, so I'm just going to introduce you to my favorite video game for today. It's been brand new to the channel, and if you're you can watch it. So today, I'm just going to introduce you to the channel, and I'm going to watch it. So, I'm just going to introduce you to the first thing I'm just going to show you is the interface channel. So, I'm just going to turn this one down, because I don't want to just post the same video. So, I'm going to just put this one down, because I don't want to just if you click on something, you can turn on the button to send it. So, this is not a very good idea. I just want to do it because I just want to do this as well. So, I can do this for my favorite reason. And, it's kind of cool. So, let's get to the other side. I'm going to use my hand to turn on all of this. And, that's why I'm going to do this. So first you got the paint bucket, it's nothing special, you just fill one thing in, one thing. You can make different gradients, but no, there's no shading unless you do a gradient. And only if you do a gradient, you can make one color and make it shade, or you can just make a jumble of colors. It's really cool. Second of all, you got this, it can be adjusted in a straight line. It can be in a circle, it can be in any shape you would like it to be, I guess. And then you can just like trace over it, make a perfect shape. Next, everybody probably knows what this is. With the line in the middle, you probably know that it makes a drawing and makes two of them. So that's helpful. Shapes. You got a circle, you got a square, you got a rectangle. That's an ambient noise. And so you got that. You can make any shape you want. Fill it in with the paint bucket. And it's over. This is pretty much just another pen tool. If you want to use it, I guess, instead of the normal paint brushes, I guess you can. I'm not stopping you from doing that. I'm just telling you what things are. You can add any photo, any photo. If you have any, if you want to, you can just add any photo you want. It's not stopping you from doing it. You can add whatever amount you want. You can change it to whatever size you want. It's amazing. Here, it just gives you a bunch of like pie pizza shaped lines all over your screen. I don't actually know what it's supposed to do, it just does that, so if you if you are on Autodesk or if you know stuff about Autodesk, then please write in the comments down below if I'm wrong. Text with the recording button right next to it. The T is a text and you just write any sentence, any book. If you want to, you want. And recording, I click that. It just records you drawing. You could save it to your photos, put it on iMovie, and then. And so it's perfect. And I always use recording because it's always super fast, perfect for speed paints. And so I'm just telling you that. You can just move whatever photo you pasted, you can just move your drawings. You can move whatever you want around with it. Here, you can move whatever's on the same layer around. I'll be talking about layers and literally one photo away from that. So, yeah. 
Here are the different pen tools, the different pencil tools, the different marker tools, the different brush tools. You can go down to zero opacity, 100% opacity, and more. So here are the different layers. I got my first speed paint layers up. I got my first speed paint uh, drawing up. So you get to see that. It's a beautiful masterpiece, my first speed paint. You get to see it be created. And I hope that's really fun. It's going to be posted after this, as I already said. And I please, please, please like it. Subscribe, like, share. You don't have to if you don't want to. I'm just saying I would really appreciate that.